This journey will travel, will uh, involve many changes, both in yourselves and in your environment. You will travel through valleys and mountains, good times and some not so good times. You will be tested and prodded, rewarded and overjoyed. The future may seem alternately promising and fearful, and you may sometimes be confused as to what you must do, but journey together you now must. And so you've decided to travel this road together, but even though you will not be alone, you will still need some other companions to see you safely through the trials of life and marriage. These companions are unseen and intangible, and some would say that they are non-existent, or at the very least obsolete and irrelevant. Invisible they are, but they are just as real as the hardest granite. They are just as necessary, too, for just as the foundation holds together the mightiest structures, so will these companions be the bulwark of your marriage. The first is the greatest of these mentioned earlier, and that is love. Paul describes it as the only thing of permanence. Build upon this if you seek a lasting relationship, for all else is as fleeting as the wind. Many would agree with this, and yet the word is sometimes confusing to us, and perhaps it is because we throw it around so casually. 